Four years, four years, four years. Oh, that was two years ago. Still living in Sydney, apparently. Yeah, yeah. Why? Credit 61%. So doing the things that others don't want to do. The Barrett lives in New Lambton with his wife Courtney, their son Kingston, as well as their uh, French bulldog Cheddar and their cat Beef Jerky. So no longer Cheddar. Explain. Cheddar's gone. Cheddar's gone? Yeah. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. But J Jerky left and then came back. Okay. He's back. Okay. He's so a pet. Yeah, yeah, it's about the only thing that's constant in my life. Uh, yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. Jared's hobbies and interests include <coughs> me, playing golf, going to the beach, sports, and family time. His previous jobs include real estate, <coughs> New South Wales operation manager for a labour hire company, and bar owner. And Jared's burning desire is to have more holidays while the business runs without him, and to have more investment properties. So, Jared, before you begin, do you please tell us something that no one knows about you? I'll give you a sad one and a happy one. You all know I've got race dogs. My new prize one has just got put down last week. Um, but the happy one is, I don't think anybody of you know this, I'm a, I'm a part owner in a, a punk rock and skate park over in Perth. So yeah, we've also have, uh, extended it and we've got a little art exhibition sent for the area at the back now. So yeah. Yeah. No. I can do I can do an Ollie. <laughs> yep, yep. All right, um, I ask you all to jump on the Wi-Fi. Can we all get our phones out because we're a bit interactive today? Um, I need everybody to get their phones out, get on the Wi-Fi, go to a website, kahoot.it. And play a little game. K-A-H-O-O-T dot it. IT, yes. A little game, keep you all involved, see if anyone's been listening um, since I've been here. Yeah. Here they come. Pins up the top. Pins up the top, guys. Yes, please. How many have we got? 20. <coughs> Is that everybody? <laughs> do, do you need your assistant to come and do it for you, Dana? No? Good? <laughs> oh, jeez. Life's tough. <laughs> we good, everybody? Anyone not in? All right, let's go, Deb. All right, let's see who, who's been listening. Part of it was in the, my, my bio, so let's see who's been listening. <clears throat> what are some of my hobbies, guys? Oh, sorry, guys. Can everyone see them? Yeah. You can tell, can't you, the gym? <laughs> Not everyone's got their answers in. Oh, we all, we all got it. All right, next, Deb. One. Jared, well done. Okay, as you are, uh, I'm sure you've all been listening along the way. Hey, Deb. Yep. Me and Pete in the sauna. <laughs> Me and Deb just left. <laughs> All right, next, Deb. Should be an easy one for most of you. Which one is my favourite NRL team? Mm -hmm. Well, you, if you should know. If you've, if you've seen my car, you should know. It's definitely not one of these teams. <laughs> Definitely not. Yeah. All right, we go. Right. Oh, no, 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 oh, yep, there we go. 
I don't, I don't like these six. <laughs> oh, Nick, well done. Bunnies, the one and only. All right. Nah, it's all right. Yeah. <laughs> what are the names of my workers? One of them's here. Is your name's on there. Yeah. <laughs> my, my workers. <laughs> they, you, they, they're very close these days. Oh, well, a couple of trick questions here. <laughs> did, did Danny get it wrong? <laughs> Don't know your own name, Daniel. All right. That, Cody and Daniel. You'd, you'd, you'd be think Danny, Danny was the apprentice, but he's not. He's actually the tradesman. <laughs> what does GPO stand for, guys? Everybody's got them. Everybody uses them. If Uber gets this wrong, we've got problems. <laughs> and Dad, oh, wow. Doesn't know his own name, so we don't know. <laughs> All right, we're ready, Deb. I'll probably put the time a little bit long. All right. Who, who are the three? <laughs> You're a sparky. <laughs> Jeez. Uh, general Purpose Outlet Guys, also known as a PowerPoint. What does RCD stand for? I speak about these most weeks. The safety switches in your house, if you don't have them. You probably should. Well, I tricked a few of you there. Roscoe, well done. Well done. Been paying attention. <laughs> Residential re, re, residual current device. <laughs> it's the best way to fault fight <laughs> when your RCD is tripping and won't turn back on. What's the best way to <laughs> Not a fancy you know, unplug all your appliance, guys. 80% of the time, it's your appliance that's tripping your circuit. And if that doesn't work, give me a call. <laughs> unplug your appliances. What are the colours of electrical cable? I, wor I worked with a, um, a colorblind person one time, and all you could see was light gray, dark gray, and gray. <laughs> <laughs> Red, black, and green. Active neutral earth, guys. <laughs> Red, green, and black on the screen. How often should you have your smoke alarms tested, guys? I've talked about this. It's part of the law. Meant to have it checked. How often? <laughs> Probably a good one. When I cook, How many people 26. Good work, guys. Most of you's got that right. Danny, did you get that wrong? Yeah, I got it right. Oh, Danny. Dan, Danny should know all of these. <laughs> Every 12 months, guys, by law? True or false? By law, you need to change your smoke alarms every five years. Yeah, 
All right, Deb? That is false. Every 10 years, guys. Every 10 years. Even if the batteries are still working, they need to be changed. I've talked about this in my arm, um, so obviously no one listens. Yeah. Good to. <laughs> Pete and Shannon. Pardon? Yes. Yeah. Start, start painting over in Falao. I need some more work. Okay. Yeah, it's false. Every 10 years, guys. Yeah. What voltage do we use in Australia? This might uh, trick a few people. What is the main voltage? Hoo -hoo. I hope the, the Sparkies got the, the three Sparkies in the room got that right. <laughs> Danny. <laughs> 230 volts we use in Australia these days. It was 240, not anymore. Who should you call if your switchboard looks like this? Dan Danny called me. <laughs> Isn't the yellow one or green one the same thing? Yeah. <laughs> it's what my wife said. Did you go your mum? You, you should call me. <laughs> One more. Oh, right. Oh, hello. <laughs> this is a good one, guys. It's been the best presentation you've seen in all of your days. Say <laughs> 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 green then? <laughs> <laughs> five. Five. I reckon five one green. Yes, but he got Well done, guys. Thank you for listening. Um, my numbers, you can, you can scan this. It'll take you straight to my website so you can give me an inquiry. If any of these things you don't know, you would like to know more, give me a call and um, we'll come and help you out. That is all. Oh, wow. we, have, we have some prizes. So Nick's in third. <laughs> so Nick, you get a nice stubby cooler. Oh, cheers, uh, Pete and Shannon, stubby cooler and a bucket hat. Thank you. And then Danny, you've already got a stubby cooler, but you've got Dan Murphy's. Oh, <laughs>